paper toss. So, um, as you can see, Backflip Studios created paper toss probably a little over a year ago, I'd say. And uh, as you can see, there's always an ad to start up. You can actually buy the ad free version, which is the same game but with no ads, like this one popping up right here. But it costs a dollar, so if you want to get the free version, then you probably want this. So, let's start out on easy mode. So, basically, what you want to do is the object is to flick the paper, obviously, called paper toss. And so, depending on the wind, you let's see that wind right there. You want to flick it um, in the opposite direction of which way the fan's blowing. So, fan's blowing to the right, so you're going to flick to the left. So, I want to go about that much. Ooh, that was a, that was pretty bad. So, for point six, you probably want to aim for the rim of the the paper, just to play it safe. Okay, point oh three is like nothing. So you just flick that perfectly straight. And so, okay, now the fan has shifted to the other direction, so you probably want to go a little bit past the bucket, okay? And then for four, I always aim for about the chair, so that's that's about right. And that's 3.96 is pretty much four. And another four, three in a row. Okay, so fives. Fives you want to probably hit the screen. With 5.07, you probably want to just touch the edge of the screen just barely okay 3.34 right in the middle hit that plant just cover that plant so once you start thinking in these kind of like landmarky places for each level it's easier to know where you want to throw the paper toss so for one the rim is usually a good point also the the wall is kind of a, a good starting off point so personally I like to flick with my thumb they show usually flicking with the second finger, it's a lot harder than just flicking with your thumb, which keeps it more guided. And yeah, so once you start doing this pretty often, it's going to get fairly easy and you're going to notice where the major landmarks are. So I'm just going to fast forward after this and then skip to the very end. Oh yeah, and the last thing is 5.90 is pretty much off the screen. Okay. And boop. Okay, so that's a uh, hundred, so you kind of get the feel of how you're supposed to do it. And keep watching because I'll be posting more videos. And thanks for watching. Bye.